All right, so we we now live in a small town, a small little town. Yeah, uh, like I don't even know. Honestly, I don't know the population. I don't think there's a thousand people here. So we don't even get the mail come to our own house. We have to go to the post office. Now the post office is about. I'm not 100 percent sure. I'm thinking a kilometer, kilometer and a half away, somewhere in that range. So. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna try walking walking to the post office. That's that's my thought. Every day, walk to the post office gives me some exercise, gets me outside, right? But uh, I get a lot of stuff sent to me, which is awesome. And I wanted something that I could carry it in, so a backpack. And I got lots of backpacks. But um, I've worked with this company before. It's uh, Esin. I think that's how it's pronounced. Esin. You guys can see it right here. Esin. Uh, and I've done some of their solar stuff before and I saw this one because I like their previous gear um, This is their solar backpack and I like I like the color. I'm gonna say it. I wanted something that has that kind of army green um, But this one here I thought would be perfect because I can wear this I could have my phone charging because I want to bring my phone with me or maybe my camera or whatever it is plus this would allow it to charge for my probably hour-ish walk, which would be awesome. So, here it is. This is it, in a, in, a, in a bag, right? That's it right there. So, what we're gonna do today is take a look at what, uh, what it comes with. You guys will be able to see the size. Then, we'll look at some of the specs that they talk about. And I'm gonna I'm gonna go for a quick walk to the post office. I'm gonna plug my phone into. It sounds funny, right? I'm gonna plug my phone into my backpack, and it's it's not uh, super sunny today. It's a little overcast, but I'm gonna get out a little earlier this morning because it's supposed to be uh, a hot one today. So I'd rather do this when it's a little cooler, just for my own personal well-being. Uh, and uh, we're gonna see in that hour of walking to the post office and back if my phone charges at all. All right, coming up. All right, my friends, so here we go. A uh, hundred, it's not an inexpensive backpack. It's not an expensive, and if you look at Backpacks in general, you can pay a lot of money for backpacks, especially if you talk to anybody that uses specialized backpacks, especially for things like camera gear. Now, this is the Solar Backpack 7, seven walls, solar panel charge for smart cell phones and tablets. So don't expect to charge large things, it is solar. But Solar Backpack, awesome. Enjoy free and limited on-the-go power. Which could be really cool, especially if you're someone that maybe currently just uses battery packs. Now you should be able to even charge a battery pack from this if you wanted. Seven watts, high efficiency solar cells, very cool. Charge a variety of devices, uh, directly through a five volt USB port. The removable solar charger with voltage, volt, voltage stability controller for GPS systems, MP3 players, Bluetooth speakers, and more. I never thought about that. You could bring a Bluetooth speaker with you, that's cool. Ultra lightweight. Uh, notice and package content. This package or this item without battery pack. The package includes Esing Solar Power Backpack. So you need something to plug it in. It doesn't have a battery, so don't think you're going to charge the battery inside this. This is the charger, so you need, if you want to have a USB battery pack that you carry inside here, that could be really cool as well. All right, so anyway, here it is in the bag, right? Pop this open. Here it is. You guys can see it in all its green glory. That's it. You know, it does have a little funnel through there. Um, my hope is, and I don't really talk about it here, I don't know what it's or if it is. I would hope maybe a little bit uh, any kind of waterproofing, right? It doesn't really say. Here it talks about how it charges direct, indirect charge times. Right, I'm hoping to get some kind of charge. Today's not gonna be, like I said, the sunniest of days, uh, cause it's overcast, but this means whatever we get today, you should get more 
if it was really sunny, sunny out. So this is all the stuff you can pack in it. Three layer zipper pockets, functional compartment. Yeah, I'm with you for all this goodness. I think this would be great for like hiking or just for me, right? And they have a bunch of different ones here, depending on what you're kind of going for. And good ratings. So whoever's, whoever's buying this before me, six ratings. Great backpack, very stylish. Because that's important. I get it. Stylish. Great backpack, exactly what I needed. Overall, the backpack is good. The battery charges my phone and tablet. Three stars. Hmm. What's this? It? it does charge using the solar panel, but only in direct sunlight at a pretty quick rate. The downside is the solar panel won't fully charge the battery pack. But there is no battery pack. So I'm not really sure what that means. Great for on a motorcycle. See? So all the people that five star, five star, five star, three star, and the three, third star here, I don't really understand because it doesn't come with a battery pack. So I don't, I don't get it. Anyways, here we go. This is it. You do get some adjustable. You get a little waist thing there. You know what I'm talking about? Waist strap. Decent padding. Uh, it's it's fairly firm. Take that as you want. Maybe you like that. Maybe you don't. You get a little green thing on here. Congratulations on your purchase. If you have any quest questions, here's an email address. All right, that's cool. Good padding. It looks like on the back, right? That's nice. Usually, that's also going to help separate the backpack a little bit from your back, so it's not going to get crazy sweaty. Uh, on the side, you get a little mesh pouch. A mesh mesh pouch on the other side as well. Uh, what is this? So it does have, it seems like, it maybe like a light rain because it does have some protection here. I wish they would say what it is for like weatherproofing. That seems like it would be weatherproof, at least this pouch here, because it's got that waterproof-y type material, which I like. Uh, the bottom here where this is gonna rest, of course, is a little more uh, of a firmer or just thicker material so that it, this is where it's going to wear the most. You do have some straps here to help clamp the sides down if you need to. Very cool. Uh, opening these up. Zippers seem okay. Nothing fancy, but okay. This is where you would put, I would think, your phone or whatever. And this is the... See, yeah, see, that just punches through. You get your cable through there if you want. Right, so if you got your headphones or something like that, because you got your phone in here, right? Boom, boom, okay. Nice. That's your phone and tablet spot, I guess. Next one down, we get a little bigger. Same idea, this is, this is a fairly deep one. It comes down to this section right here. Uh, and this is where you're gonna have some pouches for your pens and just some more organization. And a little spot for your keys. I like that, I like that. Cool. And then my guess is, and there's your little cinch strap if you wanna tighten that up. My guess is the last one here, somewhere. The last one right there. We're getting there. We'll undo these actually. Pop, 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 pop. Okay, these ones come um, again, mid, midway down, so they don't go all the way, midway. Good or bad? Hmm, personal preference, I'm guessing. And this is where, oh, there's your solar panel. Okay, solar panel. So I guess you can just take it off if you didn't want to. That's a much bigger one. This is, it's got some, maybe you guys can see it there. It's got some like, uh, this is a bit of padding here. And there's a couple different layers, plus a little strap. So if you want to put like your laptop back there, your iPad or whatever, a little bit. It's not crazy thick, but it's something. Now this, I'm not sure what that is. All right, okay, I, I like what's going on here. So, so the one thing I wasn't too sure of, so this is just, oh, it's just a piece that goes on top. So it's hard, hard to, I wasn't sure if it was physically attached all the time, but that's what these two pieces, or these two clamps are for. You guys see that right here, these two clamps? These ones are your fastening clamps. Get those nice and fastened, right? On both sides. You're with me, you're with me, right? Get that nice and tight for your stuff so it's not all 
whatever. And then this, I wonder, yeah, so maybe the cable goes, goes in, not necessarily out. Matches, okay, I'm with you. Yeah, see, this is, this is your cable. So this is gonna go, and you could run, my guess is you could run, uh, this gives you a micro USB, which could go into like a battery or whatever, right? There's that, you see that? There's that micro USB, right? We'll put that in there. Now what I may do is actually get a spare lightning cable and just keep it in here as well. But that's gonna come out of this because that plugs in there. And then you're gonna run it through here, not this way, through that way, right? And then this, you just kinda slap it on right here. So now, now you're all waterproof. Nope. Now you're all solar ready. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Yeah, I like that. Right? And then these are fully adjustable, of course. So I always make them nice and large. Nice and large. Because it's easier to make them small. Same with this. Here's your belt. Your belt strap. Not as much of an adjustment, but we'll see. We'll see if it's adjustable for a for a fella of my size. And we'll just kinda, I think this can just go like this. We'll make it as big as possible. Okay. Does it fit? Does it fit a big, big guy? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Does the belt fit? Okay, the belt, the belt we're having problems. Just be aware. If you're a big, a bigger fella, that's why I'm walking. I'm walking to try to be less of a bigger fella. But these, these work. And these ones, these ones not so much work. No, they will. They will one day. So what I'm going to do is these are, these are going behind. Yeah, these are going behind. I think they're going behind. Yeah, going behind and then we're gonna tighten them back up and go for a walk. Right, panel? All right, let's go for a walk. Oh, okay, so we got the bag. Uh, it's fairly sunny out, not like crazy sunny, but sunny enough, I think. And I've got my little, I haven't worn this in a long time. I think I might get the new one, the Insta360 Go. So, um, do I? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So I have my phone here, and it is currently at, I don't know if you guys can see that, it's 80%. 80% battery. Okay, that's good. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take this and got this all plugged in, got my lightning cable. And the hope is, the hope is this will be charging. So 80%, that's what we're at. So we're gonna walk, we're gonna walk down. I might even be able to tighten that a little bit. Yep. Anyways, we're gonna walk down to the post office and uh, walk back, it's a big hill. Yeah, big hill. All right, back to the post office and back, and uh, we'll see We'll see how we did. Okay. Yeah, the crazy, the crazy part about where we live is we're up on a hill. So, it's uh, gonna work one group of muscles going down the hill, and completely exhaust me coming back. Oh, I gotta start my watch. Gotta start it. I'm doing outdoor, oops, outdoor walk. Outdoor walk. All right, here we go. All right, so the other thing that I find funny is small town living, Nova Scotia. I don't know if they really know too much what like 
vlogging and that is. So, oh, they probably know. They just probably didn't expect to see it in their town. But it's happening. Oh yeah, it's happening. All right, the, the hill down, not too bad, not too bad. Alright, so as you may or may not be able to see, uh, it's uh, it's pretty overcast today. So, I don't know how well this is going to do, but if it does okay, then on a sunny day, it should, it should do better, right? should do better. Alright, we're walking. That hill is, that hill is steep, and I'm out of shape. But every day has to go. Every day, from now on, till winter maybe. Oh, so steep. Oh, 142 beats per minute right now. Oh, oh yeah, hold on. Oh, oh so hot. Oh, hot. Okay. So, stop that. 2.9 kilometers. That's okay. 2.9 kilometers. Maybe it's, maybe it's the heat. Maybe that's what's doing it. No, that's not what's doing it. It's the fact that I'm out of shape. All right, let's see what my phone's at. It was at 80. And we are 85. 85, so that's okay. Now the phone was off, right? So, if it was on, I don't know how much it would be getting, but it was off, and because of that, it was just charging over time. So, a little bit, and we were gone for about an, about an hour-ish. So, I don't think that's too bad. Definitely more than you'd get if you were just had it in your backpack, not plugged into anything, right? I'm gonna leave this cable connected in here like all the time and you can see up at the top maybe right it's got that little charging indicator right there so yeah it's good all right guys i'm gonna leave you there i'm gonna go in have something to eat have uh something to drink and uh that's it we'll see you guys tomorrow like comment share subscribe hit the bell tomorrow later Oh, so now that I'm inside, oh, the sweat, the sweat. Have you, have you tried this stuff right here, this stuff? It's like this PC sparkling water, but it's, you can get it in like root beer flavored and ginger ale and all that. Yeah, and not bad, not bad. I'm trying to wean myself off a, off a pop. Yeah, off a pop. All right, later.